Vice Chief of Defense Forces Lieutenant General Charles Murray Ukahariri will act as the Chief of Defense Forces, officials said. This follows the death of CDF General Francis Ogola in a helicopter crash on Thursday in Cinderaria, Cabin Location, Top Division, in Algeo Maraquit County. Retired General Dordi Tunji told journalists in his Kaital home there is no vacuum in the military because there is a VCDF. Lieutenant Gen Kahariri sat in as the acting CDF immediately the tragedy occurred and will remain defense chief until when a substantive general is appointed and named by the president in accordance with the law. The National Defense Council will meet and deliberate on who will be the next military boss and advise the president, who will make the appointment. The recently announced changes in the military had sparked succession speculation in and outside the institution. And even though Gen Ogola had a year or two to serve, speculations were rife on who would succeed him following changes announced on March 8 by the Defense Council. The next CDF will come from the Kenyan Navy. Gen Ogola was to retire next year. Gen Ogola still eligible for an extension in office by a year if the Defense Council, which he is a member of, advised so. This now leaves Lieutenant Gen Kahariri, Vice-Chancellor National Defense University Lieutenant General Jimson Mutai and the VCDF as the possible successors. Under the norms in the military, Lieutenant Gen Mutai and Major Gen Ganga stand the best chance to succeed Gen Ogola because they have both been service commanders. Being as a service commander is a consideration in naming of a CDF. Lieutenant Gen Kahariri served as Deputy Commander of the Kenyan Navy, apart from Major Gen Ganga. The other service commanders are Kenya Army Commander Lieutenant General David Taras and Air Force Commander Major General John Omenda. The Kenya Defense Forces Act says a CDF 